previously on Cloud Watching. Okay, so I saw a little bit of cumulonimbus, a little bit of cumulus, and a little bit more astratus. So now that's where we're at now. Never. This is the coffee. It looks the way coffee is going to look from now on. The coffee. Oh, wherever Peter Pan peanut butter is served. This one looks like Jimmy Neutron. And this one looks like M.A. Larson. This one looks like Tim Allen. And this one looks like... <sighs> Have you seen this pony? Yeah, I live down the street from well, him. Well, now you don't. And this is all because I... I'm fed up with your disregard for me, trapping me in the void for who knows how long. Oh, you know, at minimum, like, two, maybe three. At minimum? See, this is why I'm trapping you in the void. Because you are a menace to society, and you need to be stopped. For too long, I thought you were my friend. But you weren't. And you were just a bully. The part in Finding Nemo, where Nemo is trying to escape from the little fish tank, so he swims through a, a pipe, but then the pebble breaks, and, and then he just slides to his death. And not only is your constant neglect of everything and everyone around you a constant danger for everyone involved, you've killed at least 63 ponies and you don't even show a lick of remorse, and that's why you'll forever... Come on, Red, you got this. Go, Red. Go, Red. You can do this, Red. Aw, oh, man. I have to be connected to the Wi-Fi if I want more of Red Space and the Blue Space. Hey, man, what's your Wi-Fi password? Oh, yeah, it's boil that hot dog 763 Thank you. With this information, I can now play Red Fill Blue Fill Red more. Yeah, you're doing it. You're doing such a good job, Red. I believe in you. I believe in you so much, Red. Goodbye, I believe. Yes. Seaweed Breeze was depressed by this information, and she was crying in the closet for about 13 hours, until thinking really hard about the time that she had with the bad leader on the sea. The time she was working at the muffin shop, and he came to her with two bits in his hand, and said, I would like a muffin, and she gave him a muffin. But this was no ordinary muffin, as this was one that had a friendship fragment in it, one that if combined with more, could unlock friendship power that may be enough to save the badly drawn OC. But there's only one way to find out. Hey man, can you refrain from breaking into my house? I'm watching television. I hate this show. Everyone knows 88 is where it's at. Yeah, 88 is great on a plate of hate when fate is a crate on a late irate Kate 8 to 8 out of 88. What? Man, me too. I trapped the badly drawn OC in the void, and he's never coming out. This is really bad. Now that he's gone, I'm going to make your who's hives. 
If I can with no distractions and thinking about clouds for 13 seconds, maybe I can unlock my The Pretty Alright Pals piece from my inner hope to bring him back. And with that, that gets two out of the three friendship fragments, because that ended up getting Apple Buckter the one that he needed. How is Brilliant Venture going to get the next, the super best friends charm? Find out on... Guys, I think there's some funk in this broadcast. Let me try to air out the waves to smoothen your connection. The badly drawn OC is a pure menace to everyone and everything around him. He leaves behind nothing but death and chaos. Every step he steps should be his last. Folks, it looks like we have a change of plans. So let's hope you guys are alright with the pretty alright pals summon fragment song. I have achieved it, and it was all thanks to my best friend in the whole world, the badly drawn OC. Brilliant Venture had achieved his goal of obtaining a friendship fragment, and now all that there's left to do is to watch Mob tell us all what his final and grand master plan is. Now to bring an air of normalcy to these treacherous lands of the unknown. The badly drawn OCs in the void, and Mob is on the loose. Find out what happens next at some point.